What's up, people? This is your boy, K Solo. Look, I was just going through the internet just now, and and I found something. And this shit that I found, it, it says it all about Jay-Z. Jay-Z is down with some fucking shit, some Illuminati shit, some, some kind of some kind of white power shit that only certain people like Will Smith, the only only elite black men could get down with it. And that's how they pick you. And 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 this is like a white group that looks out for they for their movie stars and they but you know like Will Smith, they 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 give. I mean, they pay these people. You know, it's like a like a you know like paid dudes. They pay they dudes. Uh, Jay Z, I'm pretty sure is down with them. There's proven fact that people has known that Jay Z is down with them. Uh, people like that has tried to step to to Fifty Cent, but no, you gotta have a certain amount of money. You understand what I'm saying? You gotta have. You got to have, listen, you got to have millions, okay? You got to have, to, to be down with these people, you got to have at least 500 million to to close to seven, $800 million to get down with these people. Jay-Z is almost a billionaire. Jay-Z is not that far from owning a billion dollars. Just like P. Diddy. P. Diddy's there almost. Diddy's almost there too. Oprah's there. Oprah's down with that secret society. Will Smith. Uh, who else? Who else? Oh, my God. Uh, 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 Will Smith, Oprah, um, um, Jay-Z, Beyonce, um, you know, a couple of people like that. And it's fucked up because these are fucking crackers that, that has secret society that they they the ones that run this goddamn world. Money runs this world. If you got the money, you you got the power. But remember this though, whatever 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 um, um powerful people that Jay Z's down with right now, remember he got to go with they with with they rules. Whatever they say, that's how Jay Z got to live. You understand what I'm saying? That's why probably JT don't even go to the hood no more. Because these people are banned. Yo, these people don't want you to do that no more. So so he got to live in a certain way. I want you guys to listen to this. This is 50 Cent talking about Jay-Z. Transition. You see, he has the... the he's Mr. No, so he got that pass. Mm-hmm. You see what I'm saying? Pretty so much, it's like yeah. now you know that this... It, uh, initially, Oprah would tell Beyonce not to mention him. Oprah, you hear this? Right. In your interview. Right. And then it changed to, you know what? They married, things are smoothed out. He's a no. You rock the Urkel now. glasses for six months. You are so good. The glasses equates to intelligence, non confrontational vibe. It makes you sick. No, safe. it's true. We laugh, but it's true. You know? Do you believe that? that do you believe he's down go. with some sort of secret society? Well, I believe he's in now, like with the, a different crowd. So he can't you even see? write the same music. You see? Would impact. He can't write Crime Wave. He got to make an excuse to write the aggressive content that we know him for. Like, so when he does American Gangster. I told you, I told you this guy, this guy's a different level. Hold up, hold up, guy, hold up, man. Damn, hold up. Yo, what's up, church? Yo, church. Hello. Why are you hanging up on me, man? Yo, anyway, like I said, now now I lost this, this video. This is what I don't like, man. When I'm doing something and somebody messes that up for me. Hold up, man. What happened to the video? But anyway, guys, you heard you heard Jay-Z. I mean, hold on. Right here, right here. Listen to this again. Come on. Pardon me, guys. I got a sense because I saw the film and I was motivated and I wrote it in three days. 
Right. Instead of saying, this is how I'm thinking. Have you ever been approached by the, the secret society that when a rapper, and I'm talking about when musicians, black artists reach a certain level, the See? secret soci Let's society still wants to infiltrate and control the minds of our of our youth. And so they inc they incorporate you into the secret society. These are the so same secret, people you put out messages and you that go against Jay Z's grain, down with right now. It's like you're dressed like us, but you speak for them. But you, if you see, like, I haven't been approached by anybody like that. I know that there's a point where you they have like, different expectations of you. <laughs> like Jay, when they do my president is black, they go, he knows better than that. But they don't say nothing about Jeezy. You see what I'm saying? Being on the same song. Cause they look at him like he doesn't know better than that. Okay. You know, and it, it's it's a point where you, where some artists start to want to be something different. And there's nothing wrong. Yeah. With I being mean, something different. When you get older, you you know you start to be a little more mature. There's certain things start making sense to you. Certain things don't. And and it's obvious he's at a point where he nothing really matters to him outside of you his you know, relationship, his family. And maybe, you know, that works for him. But when he makes comments like, nobody's scared of 50 Cent yeah. in regards to Kanye. and That was, you know what that was? It's the non-confrontational vibe we just talked about. Like, he, the guy who was talking to him made him feel like a punk. Mm -hmm. And he had to point out, come on, get it right. Nobody's scared of 50. You know what I'm saying? Like, they don't have an issue with me. I didn't say nothing to him. Right. You know what I'm saying? At that point, he's, he's not addressing the guy, treating him like he was afraid of 50 Cent. And that guy's doing that based on him being safe, uh, you know, like having a more approachable vibe. Like, Lil Mama, there's points where people enjoy music. 2003 to 2005, you couldn't find anybody that, that said that they would generate more interest than 50 Cent in hip hop. And wasn't anyone walking on the stage. What up? Because people was getting stabbed at a war show. Right. What up? You know, it was different things that was happening that made them feel like, wait, he might not be in the mood for me right now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So I, I'd watch artists look and not be sure that they can come say what's up. Like, they'll say what's up to Tony in the banks and say, tell son I said what's up. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right, they don't right. know, like, how how I was because they see me addressing other artists and competing. And they're afraid. We're, here's a little... They're afraid. I have to admit, and I told Nelson, I said, I'd be wanting to call the office and have conversations, but he might be taping. And I can't, like, because that's how our no. mind sometimes... You, know, you see what I'm saying? Yo, that was, that was this is something that's been going on for a minute, for a minute. I keep telling your people, but your people want to keep defending Jay-Z. Jay-Z, it doesn't give a fuck about you. Don't give a fuck about me. Don't give a fuck about his father. That his father's out there still collecting cans. And you people got the nerve to defend this man. What is wrong with you guys, man? You in that Jay-Z spell? What the man has done for New York? What the man has done for Brooklyn? Serious, what the man has done for Brooklyn? Has he bought anything? Has he bought anything to give to Brooklyn? Has he donated anything to Brooklyn? To New York? No? But go and see what else he donated to. I want you people to go on your YouTube and find out other shit that he donated. Donated to the white people. Hundreds of thousands of dollars. Okay? Check it out. Because your guys may be saying, oh, this nigga solo talking shit. Nah, I ain't talking shit, and I'm not hating. I am not hating. If anything, God damn it, I love that man making money. Let that black man make money. Let that Spanish man make money. But what's the use of making money for if you're going to get down with a fucking, uh, some kind of Illuminati crew, some kind of shit that want to rule the world, and they got you, and you know they hate blacks and Spanish, but they got to take you because of your money. They can use your money. And they're using him for his money. Just like they're using Will Smith. Okay? And that solid, uh, science, whatever the fuck uh, religion that Will Smith is in. Guys, you got to wake up, man. Let these, let these rappers know, man. You get that money, stop. 
stop, stop going, they turning white. Okay, you got rappers that are turning fucking white. They doing what the white people do. I mean, if you're going to do something white, man, make it look something positive, not no crazy shit. Joining some fucking society that only millionaires can join and each other freaking off with each other's wife because that's what it's about. You got shit like that. I don't want to hear no. I don't want to hear none of that shit. You can be a secret society, some freak shit. Or not some evil shit. And I'm, I told you people, Jay-Z got, Jay-Z's colors has changed, bro. I met Jay-Z personally. Okay, I has worked for him. And I tell you guys, that dude is no fucking good. Like I said, if that guy ever said hello to me once, B, I'm fucking lying to you. He used to look at me like, yeah, that's the motherfucker that kept, that picked up my wife. Worked there nine months. Had to get the fuck out. You feeling me, yo? So, yes, I stand by my gun. Jay-Z is a piece of shit. Straight out. Period. K-Solo. Yo, keep sleeping on Jay-Z. I think it's a cracker. Period. Bye.